Hello, I am Adela and today I'll be making my favorite tiramisu from scratch. It's a classic Italian dessert and this version excludes raw eggs. In a heat-proof bowl, whisk together the egg yolks and sugar until they form a smooth and creamy mixture. Set the bowl over a pot of gently simmering water, ensuring the bottom doesn't touch the water. Continue whisking constantly until the mixture thickens and doubles in volume, typically around 5 to 7 minutes. Remove from heat and allow it to cool slightly. Mix the cream for 2-3 minutes using a hand mixer. This step incorporates air into the mixture, resulting in a lighter and fluffier texture. Whisk the mascarpone cheese in a separate bowl until it becomes smooth and creamy. Combine the mascarpone cheese with the cooled egg mixture, whisking until the ingredients are thoroughly incorporated and smooth. For enhanced flavor, add vanilla extract and blend it in gently to infuse the mixture with a natural and delightful taste. Whip the cold heavy cream in another bowl until medium stiff peaks form. Gently fold the whipped cream into the mascarpone mixture until fully combined, creating a light and fluffy texture. Before assembling the tiramisu, spread a thin layer of the mascarpone mixture evenly across the bottom of your serving dish. This layer acts as a protective barrier, preventing the lady fingers from becoming too soggy. Quickly dip each lady finger into the coffee, ensuring they are lightly soaked but not overly saturated. The goal is to coat the lady fingers with enough coffee to impart flavor and moisture without making them overly soggy. Arrange a layer of the soaked lady fingers on top of the mascarpone mixture in the serving dish. Spread the mascarpone mixture evenly over the layer of the lady fingers using a spatula. Ensure to cover the lady fingers completely and smooth out the surface for a uniform appearance. Repeat the layering process with another layer of soaked lady fingers and the remaining mascarpone mixture. Cover the tiramisu with plastic wrap and refrigerate for at least 4 hours or preferably overnight. This allows the flavors to melt together and the dessert to set properly. Just before serving, dust the top of the tiramisu with unsweetened cocoa powder for a final touch of flavor and presentation. Serve the tiramisu chilled and enjoy the decadent flavors of this classic Italian dessert. Enjoy the delicious taste of my tiramisu, a perfect mix of creamy mascarpone, coffee-soaked biscuits and a touch of cocoa. 
Each bite is a blend of flavors that feels like a cozy hug for your taste buds. It's a classic treat that brings a little piece of Italy to your table, making every moment feel special and satisfying. Dive into this dessert and let its simple goodness whisk you into a world of pure delight. If you enjoyed this video recipe, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more delicious recipes. Happy cooking and see you in the kitchen!